St. Lucia has lost an illustrious son of the soil. National cultural icon Honorable Charles Cadet died Sunday, 17 January 2021 after a prolonged illness. The renowned composer was 96 years old. Honorable Cadet was born on December 16, 1924, into a family with an intense love of music and was well endowed with the musical talent to express that love. In a statement, the Cultural Development Foundation, CDF, highlighted his service to the government and people of St. Lucia in a distinguished career of some 40 years. Honorable Charles Cadet served in several capacities, including permanent secretary, Councillor for Trade for the OECS subregion from 1976 to 1986, Acting High Commissioner to London 1986 to 1987. He was awarded Commander of the Order of the British Empire 1987 and St. Lucia Cross in 2005 in recognition of his distinguished and outstanding services. He was the first recipient of the MNC Fine Arts Lifetime Achievement Award. His compositions, Chaussé Marianne and Poinsettia Blossom, remain classics and relevant in today's society. Meanwhile, Minister with Responsibility for Culture and Creative Industries, Senator Honorable Fortuna Bell Rose, has described Honorable Charles Cadet as a national and treasured gem. Jesse Leos tells us more. The government of St. Lucia pays tribute to the late cultural figure Honorable Charles Cadet, who passed away over the weekend. A prolific composer, Cadet is remembered for his invaluable contribution to arts and culture, having penned the iconic tunes for the play Banjo Man and the musical Chanson Marianne, the Guitar Man song, The Legend of Tom Fool, The Wonderful World of Brother Rabbit, and last but certainly not least, the classic Christmas record Poinsettia Blossom. Cadet also served the government and people of St. Lucia in a distinguished career spanning 40 years in several capacities, including permanent secretary, Councillor for Trade for the OECS subregion 1976 to 1986 and Acting High Commissioner to London from 1986 to 1987. On behalf of the government and people of St. Lucia, we really want to extend sincere condolences to the family um, of Honorable Charles Cadet. Charles, as you know, um, was a phenomenal St. Lucian. Um, he contributed significantly to the development of our folk music. Um, he also was a public servant, extraordinaire. What I got most out of him was a continuous desire, you know, to perfect the craft in every possible way. Cadet has over the years received many awards for his musical genius and service to country. They include the Queen Elizabeth II Diamond Jubilee Medal for 2012, the St. Lucia Cross for Distinguished and Outstanding Service to St. Lucia in 2005, and the Commander of the Most Excellent Order of the British Empire in 1987. He had received the recognition um, in our society. I think what we need to do and to continue to do as a country is to ensure that the legacy lives on. Um, the work that he did, um, the standards and values that he espoused, you know, is what as a society we need to continue, you know, um, to foster. Charles was committed to his craft. Um, he was a perfectionist. Um, and we, these are lessons, you know, that we, we continue to learn and we want, we want to value to ensure that our citizens continue um, in that vein. And so I know the Folk Research Center, the Cultural Development Foundation, these institutions are grieving um, because of his loss. But I know that they had worked with him daily. And so the work that he has done um, will continue to live on, not only in terms of the, the, the documentation, but in the hearts, you know, and, and lifestyles that we live, you know, as citizens of this country. Honorable Charles Cadet passed away at four o'clock Sunday morning, 17th January 2021, at the age of 96. For the Government Information Service, I am Jesse Leons reporting.